I am joined now from Germany by Jürgen Hambrecht, BASF's chief executive. Uh, good morning to you. Uh, good news uh, from the fourth quarter, and net income is up, but overall uh, down almost half on 2008 to net. Is this just because of the recession? No, it's not only because of the recession, but this is the main reason. It's also because we made, even in the biggest crisis here, in the toughest times, a big acquisition with CBA, and this really has an impact on our earnings. Now, what are the key points for you to focus on going forward? Yeah, we will focus on profitable growth, and uh, as uh, I would say, the sentiment has improved quite a bit, but dark clouds are still hanging around. We focus on what we have in our hands by really rigorously continuing our uh, cost improvement and efficiency improvement programs. At the same time, we will shape our future by investing in uh, growth markets in Asia as well as in R&D. R&D expenditures, we increase. Now you talk about dark clouds are hanging around. Uh, how is it looking at the beginning of 2010? Now things has improved uh, a little bit uh, over the quarters uh, continuously, and we see this also into 2010. However, we should uh, also consider that there is some uh, restocking going on, and as we go forward in the year, uh, the growth will be slow. Recovery will be slow and uneven from region to region and our industry branches uh, throughout the world. Well, one of those regions uh, is China. How significant have your earnings been there? Now, China, of course, is a growth engine at this very moment, whereas Europe and North America economies are still sputtering. So Asia, and especially China, is on our heart, and we have been the biggest investor in China for a long time in the chemical industry. And at this very moment, we are enlarging our biggest site in China very significantly. Now, uh, is, can you give us a progress report on selling your styrene business? Uh, you made profits, I think, in the fourth quarter. Does that make it easier to sell? Uh, I'm afraid that I cannot give you any further details on that one. We are still working on it, and if it's right, at the right time, I will come back to you and tell you what yeah. we are going to do. Thank you very much. Uh, on possible acquisitions, uh, will uh, you be thinking about buying in 2010? Yeah, I've, uh, M&A activities are still a major issue for us. However, at this very moment, we are focusing still on the integration of CBA, and uh, this will continue during the first quarter. Now, the euro is uh, at its weakest today in over a year. How much uh, does the current instability within the eurozone worry you? It is a worry for us. However, Europe in its own is a, uh, let me say, a uni unified market. And this is a big, big advantage if we remember back to the crisis in 93, where all the currency moved forth and back and destroyed really the business sense in Europe. This time it's different. However, we are concerned about Greece and the consequences out of it. The complexity is too high to translate it into business action. This is why we are focused on our own, what we have in our hand, and this is efficiency improvement in shaping the future. Jürgen Hambrecht, thank you very much indeed for joining us this morning.